Hey everyone, it's Elliot here. So you've been staring at that frustrating iPhone lock to owner message, right? We've all been there and it can be super annoying. Maybe you've even looked up some sketchy methods or expensive third-party services claiming they can fix it. Well, before you go down that rabbit hole, let me stop you right there. In today's video, I'm going to show you some safe, legal, and totally free ways to bypass the iCloud activation lock on your iPhone, iPad, or even Apple Watch. These methods are not only straightforward, but also guaranteed to work. So stick around and let's get your device back up and running. Just a heads up, this info is for people who own their devices but forgot their login details. We don't support or encourage breaking the law like trying to unlock stolen devices. Respect the law and others' property. Our video follows YouTube's rules. Now let's get started. All right, let's jump straight into it. You've probably come across a bunch of pricey services or software claiming they can remove the iPhone lock to owner screen. Some of them might even seem legit, but trust me, there's a much better way to go about this, and it's both safer and free. Before we dive into those solutions, let me clarify. This is just for educational purposes. If you own the device and simply forgot your access details, you're in the right place. We're not here to hack stolen phones or anything shady. So what are your best options? There are some solid iCloud unlock services out there like Unlock Here's AI-powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, Lock to Owner, and the iUnlock app. These services are designed to help you safely and legally bypass the activation lock. Imagine buying a secondhand iPhone online only to discover it's locked to the previous owner's iCloud account. That can be a real headache, right? You might start looking for help and end up feeling overwhelmed by all the sketchy solutions out there. That's where these trusted services come in, offering a dependable way to regain access to your device. So stick around and let's get into the nitty gritty of how to actually use Unlock Here's AI Unlocking Assistant to get your device unlocked. You should know that these unlock services only work in first world countries. If you can't access the services or prefer not to use them, we've got you covered. We're offering 250 free unlocks every week to our viewers. To enter, just follow these steps. Like this video, subscribe to our channel, and comment your iPhone model, your IMEI number, and your country. Once you've completed these steps, you're automatically entered for a chance to get a free unlock. Now let's get your device unlocked. First, open your browser on your phone or computer and go to unlockhere.com. This is an AI assistant powered web app that helps you unlock any mobile phone restriction you might have. Once you're there, let Nifty the AI bot know that you need an iCloud unlock by clicking on Remove Activation Lock. Then select that you have an iPhone, but you can also choose iPad or Apple Watch. Next, enter the IMEI or serial number. For iPhones, choose IMEI. Some iPads and Apple Watches with a SIM card slot or cellular capacity also have IMEIs. If your device doesn't have one, enter the serial number instead. To find this info on your lock device, press the sleep button. Then press it again and tap on the I icon on the bottom right. It will show your device information. Don't forget to input the device info in the next step. Enter your basic info to attach the order to your account. Make sure it's real so you can get your order confirmation. You will receive a confirmation code sent to your email that you need to confirm. Check the box to agree to the terms and that you're not unlocking a stolen device, then tap Start Process. Solve the quick CAPTCHA to prove you're not a robot. You will get an email with a confirmation code. Also, check your spam or junk folder just in case it lands there. Take the confirmation code, click the button to go to the page where you need to enter it, and once again, confirm you're not a robot. Once entered, your unlock process has started and your device will be unlocked. As you can see here, we swipe up to see the iPhone lock to owner page. In this part, it really takes time and patience. We wait for the unlock process to activate the phone, and as you can see, we swipe left and wait for a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Don't worry, it'll be worth the wait. You will enjoy your phone once again once it's finally unlocked, so it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. Patience is the key here. And there it is. In this part, let's skip all the setup. Don't worry, you can go back to set it all up later. Make sure to check the terms and conditions and skip the rest of the steps and just do it all later on. And there you have it. It says, welcome to iPhone. Now go to settings and create your own Apple ID. Tap forget password or don't have Apple ID to create a new one. And here you can just add your personal details to continue. And here's a shortcut to check your device info, making sure that this is legit. And yeah, your device is now fully unlocked and ready to use. All right, guys, here are some more alternative ways to remove iCloud activation lock legally. You'll want to know these options, especially if other methods didn't work for you. Your first stop should always be Apple support. 
If you have Proxoff of Ownership, they can help you remove the activation lock. This is the most straightforward and secure way to unlock your iPhone, iPad, or Apple Watch. If you bought a secondhand device, try contacting the previous owner. They can remove the device from their iCloud account by logging into iCloud.com and selecting Find My iPhone. It's a quick process if you can get a hold of them. There are some trusted services like Unlock Here's AI powered unlocking web app, Safe Unlocks, Lock2 Owner, and the iUnlock app. These can help you bypass the iCloud activation lock legally and securely. They are user friendly and come recommended in various tech communities. Always ensure that any method you use respects the law. Bypassing the activation lock on stolen devices is illegal and unethical. Keeping your actions legitimate will save you from potential legal troubles. That's all for today. See you in the next video.